I drove over an hour and hiked over five miles lugging in all my gear just for the chance, the sheer chance that I would get lucky enough to be able to land this campsite right here. Why? Because this campsite has a view that I want to get a photo of at sunset. And that view is right there. The clouds, I'm hoping, will give some dramatic and extra pop of colors, some more personality. Because the clouds look crazy right now. They're super fluffy. Real puffy. And the reason I packed all my stuff in is because I'm not hiking over five miles out of here in the dark. I don't like hiking in the dark if I don't have to. Um, especially five miles. My knee hasn't been 100% for like a month now. So I got compression on it. Actually, the compression right under the knee is and the calf area is helping a lot. So um, I'm leaving it there. I got my hammock set up, my whole shelter right here, and then my chair and my fire. I already collected some firewood, which isn't enough by any means, but it's going to have to do. And I had to hand carry Big Bertha here, the 6D. So this is home for the night. We will be, well right now it's just a waiting game. Still got four hours before sun set. Now we wait and enjoy the wind. feel a hundred times better there's always a part of me where I'm like I'll wait to change just in case something happens or um, like gear malfunction or something and I just need to it'd be easier just to hike back out so I'll just leave my my hiking stuff on and I'm still sweating while setting stuff up and all that good stuff so that way when I put this stuff on I know I'm not going to be like super active and then make all this stuff sweaty. Alright, got all my wood. <laughs> kind of OCD-ish I guess. I got my mediums, my larges, my tenders, and then a tender bundle inside. Since I don't have a lot of wood, I'm going to wait until it's dark dark. Sun is going down very quickly. All the clouds are kind of gone now. It's kind of, I was really hoping for a dramatic sunset with all the clouds, but it doesn't look to be the case. It's still getting windy though. Hopefully the wind doesn't do this all night. It's hard to have a fire. And I don't want, you know, 
My tarp could be slapping all night. That's annoying. Good news is sun is setting. Right there. Problem is sun is setting in the wrong spot than I thought it was going to. I thought it was going to be more over here. Um, and all the clouds are like gone. So probably aren't going to get what we want. However, there are some clouds right over here. Right there. So hoping hoping those pop out a little more. I got my composition set on how I want it and we'll see how it goes here shortly. Well, it does look cool. It does look like the clouds are on fire right there though, which look cool. But I do not have a telephoto. I am trying to get wide landscapes. So, 35 is all I got. That's okay. You know, this is part of it though. Nature does not cooperate well. Super relaxing day. Best weather I've had in a long time to where I've been able to go hike and camp and take photos. So, I mean, can't complain. I literally did nothing today and it was fabulous. Now while this isn't my favorite shot, it is my favorite out of the few that I did take. I did try using the trees around to try to frame the photo, but with the clouds moving out, it really, I really feel like this photo is just very flat and nothing spectacular. With that being said, this is my favorite shot of the few that I did take. Not the morning I was hoping for. Mm. Looks like it could rain any minute. I feel like I got some good shots last night though. I was playing around with my phone, shooting, trying to shoot the stars through the trees and everything. I got some, I feel like I got some okay shots. I'm just gonna pack up and start heading out find some photos along the way. This is the worst part, packing up and then knowing how far you gotta hike out the same way you came. All right. Now after realizing I should lose some weight, I packed up and started hiking out. And then I hit my favorite part of the, the trail here, which is like a pine forest area with pine needles everywhere. And that's where I got this shot here. I've been looking for more scenes like this ever since Pacific Northwest. I just like the way the colors are. And I also like this look up shot of the pine forest as well. Those shots are always so simple, but they always look really cool. But those were the only two shots I got on my hike back. Also, my knee was feeling better and I decided not to use the compression sleeve on my hike back. Also, not going to say that I forgot to put it on. Even though the photos didn't come out like I was hoping for, that's just the way nature is. But I'll always take an excuse to go on a camping trip. So, hope you guys enjoyed the video. 
please consider liking and subscribing. And as always, I will see you oh, in the next one. You can see the car. Here she is. In all its glory. Oh, baby.